another episode on this channel i know it's been long without me but school starts but right now you can see i'm back home and i'm done with school i don't know whether to call myself a graduate or not because i don't know if you're even going to have a graduation but this is me and i'm back home and we're going to continue with our videos but on this episode you're going to talk about my school life school life yeah but before that um if you're new to this channel make sure you subscribe and you click on the notification button so anytime i post a new video you'll be the first to watch all right let's continue with the video so hmm, i went to king university Kwame Nkrumah university of science and technology i was a student of english uh, I was in the College of Humanities and Social Sciences. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to put you through my first year on this episode. Then on the other episode, I put you through the other years. So in first year, I was in Africa Hall. Yeah, on the fifth floor. I don't know whether it was Sudan or South Africa. I'm not sure about that, but I was on the fifth floor. I had three roommates, um, Esther, Patient, and Roma. You know how girls behave. In the beginning, it was rough, like really rough. There was this small, small cries about this, that, and a lot of things. But as time went by, you, you get to know who to move with. So let me put you through some time in my room. Then we continue with the outside things. Uh, in my room, um, patient was everything. You can go to church with her, you can go to party with her, you can go to drink up with her, you can go to a lot of things with her. She was everything to me. So I was, she was the one I was doing my most with. Esther was, she was like the church girl. Yeah. Everything church, 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 church is her. And Roma, Roma was this, I don't know whether to say a party girl or she's, she's this life girl. She moves out anytime she wants, she comes in time, she goes here, there, goes home, wherever. I think she was married and had a kid, but she didn't look like a mother anyway, I'm sorry. So, this is how my room was, the church girl, the everywhere girl who was and Roma who was everything. I had little quarrels with Roma because she, she was like, um, I make a lot of calls and I talk too much on phone. I don't I don't know why this girl was she was trying to get me talk or trying to make me angry. Besides if you're on a call you're supposed to talk. So am I supposed to keep quiet on phones? So I just gave her my part. You know. I can't I can't be in the room where she didn't pay for me and she wants to be the mother of the room. That is not allowed wherever I, I get to. Not not that I'm bossy, but I don't allow that. If you didn't pay for me, I don't allow that. So we are not on good terms. Then Esther Day she was cool just that there were these little little things you have to tell her and she's bored that like she puts water she goes out to fetch water in a pail then come to pour it in the um kettle to heat and it's not nice because maybe i might be drinking from the kettle not to drink as in boil hot water and make it tea or miller get it and she's bored and she was hiding a lot of stuff like she doesn't want a boyfriend she doesn't want to, you know this what church girls most church girls do she was that kind but she was finally caught with this guy i don't want to mention him and patient <laughs> patient was supportive i won't lie she was everything she was here with me she was there with me she was eating with me, she was cooking for me, 
we are talking about stars you know her boyfriend and a friend of mine were in the same department so they come there we talk patients let's go here abby let's get here this that's here so patients was she was the one i was really clicking with so we were, we were everywhere that was us so that was my room yeah so in first year uh, i made an attempt to join mexican usd pageantry so uh, i won't say it went but it was my first pageantry so cool but it was nice i couldn't get to the finals yeah but everything was cool now i think that was my first pageantry yeah that was my first pageantry Mm. Mm. so life and first year wasn't easy it was never easy because you don't you don't know your left you don't know your right you don't know where you're going to you don't you don't know where you're moving to where you can when you're coming back when you're supposed to go it wasn't easy and you know people are trying to be on top of others others are dressing good you don't know where you stand whether you are trying to join the bad ones you're trying to join the good ones or you're going to be in between it was it was not easy i know i've been a good girl in school i've, I've always been a good girl in school i joined this modeling agency i took some some pictures then i think i had to leave because i'm sorry to say they were not serious they were not serious so i had to leave that modeling agency and concentrate on my studies so party life in kenya USA. you know you have whole weeks um fresh affairs mtn blah blah slc week yeah and these occasional things um valentine was the most top because that is the most celebrated one easter and the rest there they were nothing to us i'm sorry to say not nothing to us but it wasn't something you really celebrate in school most of us were in the house so i'm sorry i'm sorry to say that because most of the times i'm not in the school i'm home to join my family celebrate wait so that was first year for me uh, i went to i went to report i went to report report for a week i went to conti i went for indies my whole the only place i didn't go was cut because it was too far from my place and i didn't like nine to work so mm. first year taught me a lot of things You know, I won't lie, there are a lot of things I do. I'm a spendthrift. I like spending a lot. Sometimes they're unnecessary. I spend on friends. I, I don't really like food, so I spend on sweets. I spend on unnecessary things, but first, it does me a lot of things. Hunger. Just spend. If you're not from a rich poor girl and you, you want to go to school and spend a lot, you're going to kill yourself. I won't lie to you. So there are some things you should know before you get to Kenya University. Did I ever get lost? I'm not sure I ever got lost in school because I'm not going everywhere. I only go to where I'm invited or where I'm supposed to be. So there are how many was we have um Africa, which is during my time it was only females but now it's max um two towers males at the side females at the other block then um kunti which was only males but now i think it's mix we have um queens which is mix rapport which is mix um index mix then cut so in oh i think we have six holes and right now except cut the rest of the horse are all mixed. The most fun during my time was Africa, which was, I went to school in 2016. 
but now I don't know. I don't know which one was leading. Because after after first day I went outside campus, nothing really entertained me in school except going to visit friends. So then food. You're supposed supposed to be cooking a lot. Food on campus is very expensive. If if it's not expensive, it means it's not nice. Being sincere with you. So unless you say you want to eat it just like that. But if you want to eat nice food, it's either you buy it at an expensive cost or you cook it yourself. Mm, clothing. If you're watching a lot of people, I think you're going to spend all your money on clothing. Yeah, but you know you have to look good. There are sometimes you have to get new clothes, get to buy something new. You see that thing, but if you're supposed to be looking at looking at people a lot, you're going to spend more money on clothing. Food is not a problem, as I said earlier. Ah, friends, first year friends. I made friends a lot you know we have fake friends we have bad friends we have good friends we have friends friends i mean close friends and you have normal people some people you are just acquainted with they are not just friends so i'll start with the fake friends um um before school i was in this friend type it's not like I didn't want people close to me, but I've I've seen people go through a lot of issues and problems because of friends. So, um, fake friends. Hmm, I got quiet. People who pretended to like you, but inwardly, they they hate you to it. They they hate you too much. They already don't it. They hate you too much. But you know, you have to pretend and move along with those people because as true they are teaching you a lot of things. You use them to meet other people, to know whether they are good or bad, meet other people and the rest. I, I had I had quite a number. Um true friends. I met these two guys, they were true to me. Hmm. <laughs> yeah two friends in my first year they were two, only two guys in school then friends friends they met i started meeting real friends in um second year so first year patient was was one of the true friends in first year so the rest um during second year so the first alcohol I took was in first day, can you imagine? Actually, I went out with these male friends. And you know what they can do? They're like, oh, taste it. It's nice. You can get drunk. I was like, let me try. And the next morning, I was dying. Uh, what did I do in first day? Uh, my second club outing was in first day. I think drink cups, link cups, all the apps, no, not hookups. That one is not bad. Mm. So there were there were nothing much about me in festival. People have story and a lot of things. There were nothing. I said that I have major ones in first year. So my major ones in first year. Hmm. In first year, I was I was poisoned. Thank God I was, I was able to finish school. In first year, I was poisoned. Only God knows how, but I survived it. Um, I was assaulted. There was this evening I had to meet a friend for, I don't know whether books offered. And on my way back to my hall, I met these guys who tried touching my ass and a lot of things. In the first year, there was this guy I know um, in Kenya. 
he had tried a number of times to sleep with me so he continued when i got to school in the first year um joining miss Kane university joining them um, a modeling agency um, i think these are the few things i i encountered in first year academics wasn't it wasn't bad i won't lie academics was was smooth in first year so these are the only things i i faced in first year it wasn't a big a big thing i wasn't really a party girl in first year so i think you could so thank you for watching this video and i hope you expect the second year third year final year things and uh, yeah you're going to have fun thank you for watching this video if you are new here don't for don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification button so that you'll be the first to watch my videos and let me put you through my life in Kenya USD. If you haven't been there, or if we're still there, or if, 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 if the rest. Alright, same time on another video is bye bye.